definitely not saying I'm a prophet. I don't want to be, I don't want this to be true, but I want to post this just to have it time stamped, just in case. Please God, don't let this be right. All right, this is, uh, what is this? Wednesday, 7, 24, 24. And here it is. Your breath, like waves, ebb and flow. The foamy crests tumble over one another and disappear as the water ebbs back into the sea. The ocean is a metaphor of time. There are moments of gentle ebb and flow. The heartbeat of life, I send good to the world and I take it away. I send good and take it away, but you become accustomed to the rhythm of life. You adapt and so it is. But life can only sustain so much ease because with ease comes boredom and foolishness. It is on rising pressure as the rising tide of the evening and the darkness that you make changes. But then, as day returns, you return to status quo, to what was easy and comfortable and fun. True change requires extreme disturbance to your gentle ebb and tide, and so I bring the storm. Perhaps the storm will bring change through tearing away things that aren't desirable or unuseful. Maybe undesirable or unuseful things hang on, and then I must bring the hurricane to tear it to the ground to build from ground up. Here come the hurricanes in odd places to tear down and remove. Good and bad will suffer, but I will restore those that follow me twofold. And the hurricanes, my messengers, will be further will move further inland than ever before with power that is unusual as that one passes over land and loses the, so, so, the source of water to drive it. The hurricane will draw from moisture already in the air and will devastate the heartland. See, the earth is coming alive, the fire rising from deep in the earth, deep under the sea, will, requate, will create fiery mountains deep beneath the waves. And when the molten streams erupt, the rising fire and water birth incredible volumes of steam as never seen before. The steam rises into the atmosphere as storm clouds over land. Storms like you've never seen. Rain like in the days of Noah. That hurricane, my messenger, will join the river in the atmosphere and create the most unusual phenomenon never seen in written history. A full-blown full hurricane over the heartland. Do you think my people will pay attention as the wind and sea and waves roar? They try to toss me out of my country, but I will remain one way or another. I warn my prophets not because I want to do this, but because I don't. As sin abounds and grows, so will the size of my messenger. Repent, my people, just as Nineveh repented in sackcloth and ashes, or I will send the trifecta, volcanoes in the sea and on land, earthquakes and flood. See them work together in ways you never imagined. Imagine the sinful cities as the homeless. They pay to live on the streets perish, as was their plan. Away with the trash, let it be swept in the gutter, they will say, until I, in my perfect power, come for them, saith the Lord. I don't want this to be true. I'm, I'm, I don't want to be a prophet, but there it is. I'm posting this just to save for later just to see.